Sharky Breath. He plays video games. Okay, hello and welcome back to One Shot. So we're in the flooded passage and there is definitely a black clover here. So let's see if... Where's my journal? There we are, journal. Can I... It's not glowing. Hmm. Hmm. What am I missing? What am I missing? I'm supposed to take the disc to someone. I guess I need to have a look around and see who I need to give this disc to, because maybe there's a local <laughs> local author representative who I need to get involved before I move on from the Glen. That would make sense. So, let's see here. Squares. Yes, hello, squares. All right. Can I... Can I get through here? I can. Okay, great. And that's a, that's a circle. I remember that. Okay, that's blocked off. All right. Cool. Um. Right. Squares everywhere. Okay, so... What am I supposed to do, exactly? I need to get the journal to glow. Wait a second. Wait a second. Didn't I... Okay, no, never mind. Sorry. I've had the, um the club underscore dot exe open this entire time just to uh make sure the author doesn't pop up with any particular advice or anything but uh hmm there's nothing it's still blank can i get back to the mainland or is it all squared off i can okay great what's here? what's in here a bed was i supposed to <laughs> was i supposed to I'm, i'd imagine you are I'm a little tired from walking. Is that all right if I take a nap? Yeah, yeah, go for it, Nico. Um, <laughs> I kind of want to see if you have the same dream, because, man, you've been through some stuff. Uh, yeah, go ahead. Be right back. No dreams. Nothing. Wait a second. Another nap. Okay. I don't see Nico's dreams anymore. I don't know if that's an artifact of this different path we're taking, or... Oh, the bridge is broken. Sure is. Yeah, uh, okay. I think it must be an artifact of um, this run not being contiguous with the last runs. Um, either way, I'm a little stuck. I'm a little stuck, and Nico's always tired now, so that's fun. Uh... Shoot, what do I do? What do I do? I haven't seen anyone else around here. I don't remember the name of the guy I was supposed to find. Prototype. Wanted me to find somebody. They gave me a name. He gave me a name that I was supposed to... Supposed to find that person in the Glen. But I've never met anyone by that name. The only people whose names I know in the Glen, I've already run into. It's Calamus and Alula. Which is why I don't remember the name of the guy I'm supposed to contact. I don't know if I should bother Maze, though. That's the only other... Okay, I do know Maze's name. That's the other person whose name I know. I guess I'll go bother Maze. I guess I need her help. If I get her to have the ravines recede, the city will collapse faster. Which might open a way that wasn't open before and does fit along the lines of the whole I'm technically the bad guy of this scenario thing that seems to be developing lately. Okay, good, good, good. I can't give her the... I can't give her the sun. Thank goodness. Um, can I ask you about the journal? Nope, nope. You're busy. You're busy. I understand. I understand. Okay, okay, cool. So that's not it. What do I do? I'm stuck. Uh... Okay, I'm really stuck, though. I... I can't find anybody else to interact with. I can't use any of my items. I combined what I had into making the acidic 
wet sponge. But that doesn't do me a whole lot of good, I don't think. There are no rusty robots, they're all just squared. So, I gotta, I gotta try and figure out what I need to do here. It, this may take a minute, I, just, just hang on. Okay, I might just be a real big dumb. Just a second. <laughs> I'm a real big dumb. Okay, yes, hi. <laughs> I just didn't walk to the end of the dang room. <laughs> Alu, I mean, Alula says, Nico, Nico, what's wrong? You look like you were about to faint. It's not the first time it's happened. Oh? Earlier I was in the Barrens and I saw something like this too. It was like a dream, but only for a split second. Sounds like a vision. Like something a prophet would see. I guess? The robot lady I was with earlier had a fancy word for it, though. Wait. Let me check something. At... It, I swear it wasn't glowing a minute ago. Okay. Oh! I was right! Huh? When I had the vision back at the Barrens, the book started glowing too. I wanted to see if it could, I could get it to happen again, and, uh... Where did you get that? Oh, uh... I had it with me when I woke up in this world. It looks like one of our friend's books. Except it's glowy. That's what the lady said, too. Hmm. Sharky, let's see if we can do anything with the journal in this room. Yeah, I, I already know what to do with the journal in this room, but anyway, uh, real quick. I wonder when our friend will come back. I guess that's that's what you're focused on, huh? I wonder how long this passage is. Looks like there's some lights at the end. Those are fireflies. Okay, that could be. Anyway, glowing journal. Look at that. A boat. Now watch there be a boat all of a sudden. Whoa! How did that boat get there? <laughs> Okay, I'm pretty sure it has, has to do with this journal now. The exact same thing happened back at the Barrens. Seriously? The journal was glowing, so I wanted to take a closer look at it. Then I found a page that looked like a drawing of the room we were in, and then a minecart showed up. What? What? That sounds freaky. No, it doesn't. Sharky must have done something. <laughs> Still. Hey, we have a boat now. We can go to the burial grounds and visit Mom again. But, come on, Calamus. Nico and Sharky are with us. Well, if Sharky make the boat appear, it should be safe. I did... I... Uh, what do you think, Sharky? What do I think? I... It's not giving me any options. I guess the option would be go on the boat or don't go on the boat, huh? Yeah, let's go on the boat. Here we go. I hope this doesn't backfire horribly. I guess I'm in control. I wasn't expecting that. All right. Let's see where this passage goes. Oh, well, they are fireflies, kind of. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Just clambering on his head. Sure. Well, at least this time you're traveling with some friends? Question mark. Okay, looks like I can only go forward. That makes sense. We made it! Come on, Alula. Let's go pay our respects. Okay! Oh, they just vanished. Alright, sure. What's this? It's a gravestone. Yeah, I guess they kind of all are, huh? Odd that they're different sizes. Also, they have the emblem that we had to draw to free Alula way back in the day. And also the emblem of the room where the light bulb was after waking up in the tower. Yeah, okay. Gotta have some significance around here, huh? Don't know how much I need to poke around. It looks like it's pretty much graves. Would kind of make sense. This is her grave. Ah, oh. it's been years, but it's still hard, you know? Alula, want to help me look for some flowers for Mom later? Yes! <laughs> <sighs> Mom, you're not going to believe what happened today. We met the Messiah and... Hi, Nico. Hi.
Hmm. Anything else? I hope she can see us wherever she is. At least I still got my sister. Yeah. Yeah, at least that. I hope I can safely move the story to the next part. And not, you know, have everyone get squared like last time. But I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, hey. You're new. It's you. Uh, you, um... My name is Nico. Ah! N nice to finally meet you. No, wait. It's a pleasure to be of acquaintance at last, Nico. My name is Cedric. Cedric, huh? Okay, that's the one. Hey, you're the one. You're the one I was supposed to find. I gotta give you a disc. Oh, I'm supposed to be looking for you too. I am aware. Prototype had contacted me earlier, saying that you would be on your way to the city. He did. He sent me a message after his memories were restored. Oh. He told me to wait in the city, but I thought it'd be faster for me to pick you guys up. Turns out that was that was a terrible idea. Pick us up. Wait, you can fly that plane? No, you can fly that plane? There we go. What is a plane? That thing behind you. I didn't see it. Uh, good job, Nico. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, you mean the flying machine. They're called planes in my world. Oh. I did not realize they existed in other worlds. Wait, are you the friend that Calamus and Alula were talking about then? Is this the same flying machine that they were talking about? I do not know anyone named Calamus or Alula. I think they're meant to be friends with my father. Oh. Okay. In previous iterations of the... Your father? He was the original owner of the flying machine. It's one of his greatest inventions, actually. Your dad invented planes? <laughs> flying machine. It's cool either way! <laughs> Thanks. But to answer your earlier question, I am proficient in operating the machine. But something weird happened to the engine when I was in the air earlier. I had to make an emergency landing on this tiny island before I crashed into the city wall. You almost crashed. That's terrible. It was not pleasant, I will admit. I wonder if the engine problem has to do with the square particle disruptions. I checked, but there isn't any of that square stuff inside the machine itself. Well, thank goodness for that, anyway. But I noticed some islands in the Glen are really messed up now. They are. Huh. <sighs> Guess I should have listened to Proto in the first place. Say, where is he? He said he was coming with you. And thanks for... <laughs> is he still back at the main islands? Oh, actually... Back at the Barrens, he... There was a cave-in... And then a bunch of squares. He and the robot lady. Neither of them made it out. No. He did give me this, though. This disc he pulled from his head. Oh! Oh, thank goodness. He gave you his main drive. As long as I have this, I should be able to bring him back. R really? It's going to be hard, but yes. You need all three of us for the big door. All, what? What? The... But first things first. We need to find a way into the, to go to the city. Right. The city gate is kind of kaput now. If this machine was working, we could just fly right in there. I've isolated the issue with the machine, but I can't repair it with the stuff I have on hand. Oh, what's wrong with it? The battery in the engine is dead, and the engine has some gears that need to be replaced. Hmm. Do you think you'll be able to fix it if Sharky and I help you find those things? Maybe. Problem is, the Glen isn't exactly a very high-tech area. I'm not sure if you'll be able to find anything so specialized here. We'll try anyway. We can't really do anything else right now. I mean, that is true. <laughs> cool. So that's Cedric, huh? Oh, man. I feel real dopey for spending the first ten minutes of this uh, just wandering around because I didn't go to the end of that particular... <laughs> that particular peninsula. So, if this one goes a little long, that's on me. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, it's difficult to judge how long this is, episode actually is at this point. But anyway, let me just make sure these two don't have anything else to say. Hey, do you know where I could find a battery? Good question. We, uh, don't really use electricity in the Glen. Ah. Uh, oh, but there are robots at the research station. If there's a battery anywhere, they'd know where it is. 
Gotcha, thanks. You got anything? <laughs> I mean, probably not. Do you know where I could find some gears? Gears? What's that? It's like uh, a metal circle thing with teeth. A circle with teeth? <laughs> that sounds so silly. Like something Magpie would have. Magpie? Magpie? You know, the trader guy. Oh, sure. He collects all kinds of funny stuff. I mean, he even keeps around broken glass and junk. That's, that's true. That's a good point. Oh, yeah. I think I know who you're talking about. He's such a weirdo. <laughs> okay, cool. So I got I actually do need to go find the trader guy. Although my business is a little more dire than last time. Um, real quick, I should check out the area with the plane and make sure there's no other... Well, he's got a crowbar. It's a crowbar. Yeah, I got another one of those. Crowbar fights. Nah, it doesn't work. Is that a wrench? Just a wrench. Yep. It's a plane. Flying machine. Right. Cool. Is this fire blue, or is it me? It's a fire. I uh, guess no, nothing noteworthy here. Wait a second. The fire back in the house was blue as well. Is that is fire just blue here? Is that just a thing? Sorry, I forgot. You, I, I didn't forget. I just wanted to talk to you again. What parts do we need to find again? A battery for the engine and a few gears to replace the broken ones. If you could find the, me the parts I need, I should be able to get this machine off the ground again. Okay, cool. Can I fast travel? Heck yeah. Um, however, I don't know if that's going to do me any good because there's not a path back to the city from where I came from. I guess I should get in the boat and try from there. Okay. Yeah, I still can't go any direction other than left, so... Left it is! Cool. Alright, well I guess I gotta search this area for bits. Even though I technically just searched it for ten minutes at the beginning of this. That was, again, that was my, that was, uh, my mistake. That shouldn't have... Huh. Yeah, the squares are blocking the doorway, I know. I feel like Calamus and Alula had a bunch of stuff in their house is the thing, but I can't get in there now. If I can't get past the squares, I can't get much of anywhere. Now let me just make the make the rounds and make sure I haven't missed something. Yeah, I know. I was, I was looking to see if it had a battery, Nico, that's all. Can I fix it? can't fix it. So, okay, Magpie might have stuff, but I can't get to Magpie. There was another door out of the ruins. Wasn't it this one? Did I seriously just walk? No, 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 this is the way we're, this is where Lula was trapped. There was another door out of the ruins. I mean, not the ruins, the, the Glen ruins. Whatever. It was this way. <laughs> no. No, it's all blocked off again. Okay, okay. I can't sneak past this thing, right? No. Nope, nope, nope. Okay. Shoot, what do I do? It's different this time. Hello. I, um, have something to ask of you. Oh, no. Oh, no, I was right the first time. Yes? It looks like most of the bridges around the Glen are broken, and... That's right, the bridges. You need to cross them on your pilgrimage. Would you like me to fix them? Yeah. Is it possible? Difficult. Bridges are in very specific locations over water. Need to find the right points. Vines must be very strong to an undertaking. Ah, but possible. I intend to use the last of my strength. Please stand back. Um, what happened? 
Are you okay? Are you... It just isn't getting any better, is it? I have a feeling it's not going to get any better either. I sure hope we figure out how to fix this. They keep talking like it's not possible. And I guess I kind of get it. But... I just hope this doesn't spiral out of control, right? I was warned a lot of times that it might. So, if, in fact, that's the direction this takes, I can't really... I can't really complain. Well, okay, we can get back to the town now. I think this has probably been an episode. We're going through a lot of NPCs, aren't we? can't say as I feel good about it, but nothing for it but to keep going at this point, right? I've got everybody involved in it this time, so I've got to finish it out. Anyway, thank you for watching. Uh, next time we'll head over to the city and see if we can get the parts for the plane and hopefully get out of the Glen before everything disintegrates <laughs> like last time. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll see you next time, okay?